Hi everybody, Quadrajet Power here at quadrajetpower.com. I'm um, going to show you how to change this um, plastic vacuum brake pull-off on this uh, 68. This is a 68 Chevy. The plastic pull-off was used from 67 to 69. So it's pretty popular on uh, almost all the makes and Quadrajet models during that time. So I'm going to show you how to take the old one off, how to put the new one on. Um, this is our so CPO 492 is the code number here. So this one, this one has a clip style rod. So I'm going to pull the clip off. And we sell the clips. SKU numbers clip, as a matter of fact. So now we just slide the rod off of here so easy sometimes so you know it's not edited here right so okay so now we got the rod off now we got to get the old pull off off of here this one's all broken I'm gonna take the just a flat blade screwdriver slide it between the bracket and the pull off and I'm just gonna pry it out even if the even if these little stays are, are bent over, uh, almost all pull offs once you once you do what I did with the screwdriver, pry it off, it's gonna straighten these up enough so that it'll it'll just slide right off. Now we're gonna slide the new one on. The nipple always faces towards the vacuum hose. We'll just slide this one on, wiggle it back and forth a little bit till it gets all the way into place. So there it is. Put the vacuum hose back on it. Use, I always replace the vacuum hose. I'm just using this for an example. We're going to slide the rod back in the hole. And then we put the clip back on. I use a pair of needle nose pliers and just slide it right on. Now everything's in place. The new vacuum pull off is there. Now we're going to talk about, so this is a vacuum brake and a choke pull off. It's a dual purpose. The um, once it's once at idle, when you have vacuum, it prevents the secondaries from opening and will let them open a little slower. And once the choke is fully closed, once the vacuum brake is pulled at idle, it'll pull the choke open a little bit. It hits right here on the rod on the arm. If we needed to adjust this to get it a little further open, then I would bend this top part of the choke bracket and then once we vacuum's applied again, it opens just a little bit further. That's how you would adjust that. We also have a different rod. If you have, if you have the rod that has the bend in it, this is our VBL 842. I'm going to pull this off again. We have to have the pull off off to be able to get this rod on. But I'll show you both ways because these early carburetors come with both types. We're gonna hook the rod underneath the secondary arm there. We're gonna hook the pull off over and pull it around. We're gonna make sure that it's behind the choke bracket. And then, then we're gonna slide it into place just like we did before. So that is how you replace the, the vacuum brake pull off the rods are available the one with the clip is the rod 122 vbl 894 uh, vbl 84 sorry about that is the rod that's got the bend in it so we have both available cpo 492 the clips uh, get your parts at quarterjetpower.com we have everything you need for quadrajets. Thank you for watching.